Hello, my name is Ashley Bishop. I'm going to teach you how to port forward on the Silex routers. When you write 1923, on, you go write your routers home thing, it's automatically 192.168. Forget this part. Look, let me show you quickly. 192. Automatically go into this page. Then, password should be automatically 1234. Mine's a bit changed, I had an extra number just in case. Here, when you first start, it's wizard, but just go to advance if you don't want to bother with wizard. Then you straight away go to security firewall and you disable this here. No tick, there should be no tick there. And then you go to NAT. And most important bit is you should always have static IP. IP should be static or it won't work. We're going to try this right now as you see how the port forward did it. See it. Let me show you quickly. This shit's going to show port forward or it's going to go messy like a minute ago. This is my third time recording. Some reason when it records it won't show its port forwarding. I'm gonna add some pictures. Sorry about that, some reason it's, it does that when it's recording. As you just saw, it's just open. Some reason won't do it. It's my router t today. It's gone too hot, and when it goes hot, don't ever recommend Silex. It's hell like hell. So we'll just delete this, remove, like you saw. Then I'll redo it just to prove. Come on, boy. Come on, don't, don't make a shut the video and read to it. I'm gonna have to speed this bit up. So that, that takes just. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It's true. I disabled it and it does that. So now, if you want to open a port, we go to user defined. It should automatically do TCP and UTP. Let's just make up something. Oh, la, la, la. Same thing, so we copy paste. Here should be your static IP. If it's static, you can find by writing IP config. And go top. This is your static IP 192. Actually, mine was static IP. You write it here, 192.168, then you press apply. This should automatically do TCP and UTP. As you see. Wait, did I just delete the one on the top? Ah, oh, no, no, sorry, it's different. Like you see, that's from TeamSpeak. Now let's retry. Might have to take a few goes to get this thing working. Doesn't do that ordinarily. And if it still doesn't work the program after you port forward, it try doing it from the firewall because that sometimes blocks programs. For some reason it doesn't really show work when it's recording something disables it or something. See? Should really show that even still. I should we open the program? I'll just pause the video to it goes and I'll show. So, but that's the fun of the program today, but doesn't matter. I'll try it our time.
but your port should be open now. So I hope you have a nice day. If you have any comments, comment down. And if you have any technical questions, write on Google Silex forums and there should be a post for about this. Right now this program doesn't want to work at all. Can you find my external IP? So have a nice day, this is Ashley Bishu. Goodbye.